Sam, Sam. But, hey, listen. Uh, what? You want me to chase you into the street? I'll just... What? Give me one second to explain. What's there to explain? You and Ava Jerome were kissing. I know how that looks, all right? But you gotta understand this. Understand what? It's not confusing. Your lips were on her lips. There was nothing to misinterpret. And yet you did completely. Oh, really? You want to know why? No. I wasn't kissing Ava. Are you kidding me? Of course you were. Oh, no, oh, no, no, you weren't. Of course not. I bet you were trying to take a DNA sample and you ran out of cotton swabs, so you used your tongue instead, right? What the, what the hell are you laughing at? That was funny. Good night, Silas. No, you're not going anywhere. Who the hell are you to order me around? No one. But anytime I do that, you stay and argue if I figured it was the best way to keep you from leaving. Okay, you're, okay, you're, you're right. Um, you weren't kissing Ava. I just imagined the whole no, thing. No, you wouldn't imagine anything, but there's an explanation. I yeah, know, it's a very good explanation. It's not complicated at all, actually. You reconnected with the mother of your daughter at the wedding. I totally understand. I mean, she was the best choice since, since I said no. That's right. You did, and yet here you are. Why? Because someone convinced me to who, come. Who succeeded where I failed? <laughs> well, if you must know, Patrick Drake. Dr. Drake, he convinced you to come here tonight. That's yes. interesting, because I, I think he thinks I'm a jerk. Actually, the word he used was arrogant. arrogant yes, yes and we weren't talking about you. Talking you. About no, me, surprise. No. We talked about a lot of things, but mostly his late wife. She was a doctor, right? Yes, mm -hmm. she was amazing. You have no idea. Robin died over a year ago, just a few months before my husband was killed, and Patrick understood why I did not want to go out tonight. Yeah, I know. You, um... You said it's because you want to stay with Danny. And I did. But there's more to it than that. Yes, there's more to it. It was also about Jason. But Patrick made me realized that I wouldn't be betraying Jason if I, well, went out on a date with you. He said that Robin would want him to be happy and Jason would want the same for me. Well, I'm glad the good doctor was able to help you with that. So I, I, I got all dressed up and I hurried on over here thinking I was going to have a little fun only to find you kissing another woman. I wasn't kissing Ava. She kissed me. Yeah. Seriously? Ava forced herself on you. What, did she have a gun to your head and threaten to shoot if you didn't swap spit? No, I agreed to a little dance. Oh, 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 really? I can just imagine it. I can see Ava forcing you around the dance floor against your own the will. stupid wedding tradition, all right? Where the parents, the bride and groom, they have to dance. The only dragon she did was trying to take me down memory lane. Did you have a nice stroll? No, I did not, especially when she implied that she wanted to rekindle things with me. Is that when you didn't kiss her? No, that's when I told her in no uncertain terms that I wanted nothing to do with her. Oh, okay, so the dancing was just dancing, but the kiss was... what? It wasn't even that. I got out of my way to distance myself from Ava. The only connection that we have is our daughter. She means nothing <laughs> to me. I'm not interested in Ava. The only person I'm interested in is you. Interested in me? Yeah. Yeah? Well, you have a funny way of showing Well, it. next time I'll take out a billboard in Times Square, okay? Look, I, I know I'm not good at this. I, in circumstances, haven't always been the easiest. I mean, it seems like every conversation we've had, there's scrubs and jeans, and we're talking about Danny mm -hmm. and, 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 and Rafe. But then, you know, you walk in here tonight, and you look so damn beautiful, I nearly didn't recognize you. Hey, thanks. You know what I mean? I know. Your mom's still with Danny, right? Yeah. Let me make this right for you, all right? You know? Come back into the party with me, all right? I, I promise you we'll have a nice time. I mean, it is your daughter's wedding reception. Uh, if I told her I left because of Ava, I would have her sympathy. Come on, we'd still make a night of this. What do you say? Before you say yes, Sam, there are a few things you should know about Silas. So Get out of here. Go away. And allow a poor, unsuspecting woman to go off with you when she doesn't know you at all. It's true, actually. I mean, Silas, I, I really don't know you that well, uh, any more than, than he knows me. That's why we're spending time together. If you get involved with him, you will be sorry. Silas 
has dark secrets. He can get in line. His secrets will hurt you. He will hurt you. If, if Silas is so horrible, why do you want him back so bad? Come on, tell me. 25 words or less. Silas Clay is evil because... Go. <laughs> well, hmm? where to begin? Come on, Eva, go ahead. Tell Sam what she needs to know. Go on. You still got 21 more words to tell Sam the awful truth about me. Come on, Eva, we're waiting. Yeah. 25 words would hardly do you justice. Sam will just have to find out for herself. Good luck, Sam. You're gonna need it. You ready to go? Yes. Let's go. Please.